to 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 twelve and eight. Yeah, good job. I'll see you back. I forgot about that. Hello and welcome to this 2K Sports presentation of the no. WNBA. Our game tonight featuring the Connecticut Sun as they go up against the Phoenix Mercury. Coming from the Valley, Phoenix, Arizona, I'm Blake Suniga with our analysts Tim Swartz and Brian Vanifatemi. And we're ready to roll. There we go. And controlling the glass is how both of these teams try to control the game. Yeah, and when you talk about controlling the game, Blake, you, know, you talk about pace and the number of possessions in the game as well. Rebounding teams can kind of control that. Well, that's why you got to expect a physical, grinded out toe. Old school basketball is my favorite. And the basket by Carrington. And Carrington has proven that she can drain it from deep. She just has to keep on doing this. Rossi outside. Screen by Griner. Rossi outside. Three pointer. It's rebounded by Alyssa Thomas. Surprising miss, wouldn't you say? I mean, she usually devours those wide open opportunities. Pass to Harris. Thomas the screen. Just five to shoot. Here's Carrington. And another All right. three for Connecticut. Carrington. Putting those guard skills to work. Carrington with the quick trigger. Reiner with the screen. Beyond the arc. And Collier go. gets the three. Right back at you. They immediately get those three points. Uh, Just right. straining punches for long range. With a heavyweight fight. Now here's Thomas. Oh, okay. And the whistle blows. It's going to be on Copper. That's her first foul. First team foul. Covered by Copper. Thomas down low. Reiner is there. Five to shoot. Here's Harris. The three pointer off the mark. Yeah, she didn't punish them for the weak coverage that time, but they just can't count on her missing. Absolutely, Brian. You gotta go right back to that shot. First personal foul, the team's first. First team foul. Loud outside. A patient and productive defender, Thomas reads opponents really well. Here in the first, with just under two and a half minutes played so far, Bonner's shot is good. Perfect screen there. Set her up with a terrific look. Yeah, but that's a bad job by the defender to not fight through that screen to contest. You want to see more effort there. Now here's Tarasi. <laughs> Let's it go from deep. And the rebound goes to the sun. To the middle. The shot's good by Thomas. Four or five shots have dropped for them already. Not a bad way to get things started. Ross, in your first game back, is not the On the wing, Kalia Copper. Honor defending. Copper drives in. Pass to Cunningham. Shoots over Jones. Second shot opportunity. Copper no good. The Sun leading. Bonner with it. Dewana Bonner, double team. Harrington lays it up and in off the pretty assist. A few more points added to the lead. They might be ready to pull away. It wouldn't surprise me with as good as they're looking at the moment. Absolutely right, Brian. They're looking really strong. Now here's Cloud. Just five on the clock. Here's Copper. And that comes up. There we go. Assist by Natasha Cloud. Keeping her eyes up and her options open. Natasha Cloud is surgical in her approach. And here's Bonner. Now Harris. Tom
Thomas outside. Luana Bonner for three. Diana Taurasi grabs the miss. Phoenix trailing here. A kick out to Copper. Shoots the three. In the hoop for her third make from the field. He's three for four thus far in the contest. And so here's Connecticut. Hey, yo, right here. Bonner outside. Thomas a screen. Bonner with it. She's picked up by Griner. Here's Thomas. Good D by Kalia Copper. If she can get to the rim, she'll usually turn it into points, but the defense stood tall there. And she gets it to go. Ooh, came all the way back. Here's Bonner. 15 points in the game. Harris fires from deep. They get it back. Thomas, no good. Allen with it. And the Mercury, another three. Unfazed by that scoreless first quarter, and she's heating up. Bonner outside. Thomas outside. Eddie. Here's Nelson Adota. Here's Thomas. That one drops for her second bucket. Marker two for four. Keeps defenders uncomfortable, and I think it's because of Thomas's ability to play assertive but composed around the rim. Now here's Cloud. Here's Reiner. Bonner pulls it down. How did that not get a foul call? Yes, that's good. I love seeing Petty share the wealth, looking to get her teammates going. Rossi outside. Pass to Griner. Shoots over Petty. And again, it's Phoenix. Here the sun. 17 points was their biggest margin. Here's Bob. And so she earns a trip to the line. The officials saw the contact. Love the fearless attitude from Dewana Bonner inside. You can't be afraid to battle around the rim. She hits both from the strike. And when you talk about veterans aging gracefully, Dewana Bonner really stands out. Still such an effective player. She hasn't had one season where she averaged less than double figure points per game. Just continuing to get it done. continue to get it inside the defense struggling to just contain them and look when you make five in a row for being tight like they have it also just takes pressure off of your perimeter guys great point now here's cloud still getting warmed up offensively oh. no buckets yet in the game for her in transition here come the sun here's thomas oh. And oh, her versatility, Alyssa Thomas with three hits. She's finished in the top five in rebounds and assists. Mm -hmm. You throw in two that she's one of the better defenders in the league. So Thomas gives you playmaking, rebounding, scoring as well. An incredibly valuable player for this team. 
Well, we're at the point of the season where you know what you have and know what to expect for the rest of the season. There's going to be some surprise downfalls and surprise rises to victory. But I'd say we can predict about 80% of what's to come. Yeah, and the other 20% is why we love sports so much. It's the unpredictable that makes it so interesting. Right, really good. If you were looking only at the way she's played offensively, you'd think her team was ahead. Thomas outside. Bonner outside. They set the pick to the paint. Here's Nelson Madota. It's rebounded by Phoenix. Here's Cunningham. And the Mercury, another three. The Phoenix got a little lax defending the three-point shot at that end. Yeah, three of the last five baskets they've allowed coming from beyond the arc. Now here's Harris. No scoring yet for her, but that's likely to change. Thomas outside. Harris. Five on the clock. Nelson Adota. She's covered by Cunningham. Shot by Nelson Adota. No good. And the Mercury with possession. They trail by seven. Pass to Tarasi. The three. Get it. Get it. Get it. Offensive rebound. Huh. Reiner with the screen. Huh. And here's Karasi. The tray. Huh. Tries again. Oh, no. no good. God on damn. That shot. Great D that time from Melissa Thomas. Harris lets the three fly. The, the pressure on her in those circumstances was massive. Pressure? What pressure? You cannot rattle her no matter what the situation is. I don't even know how she did We've reached the end of the first half of play. Sun ahead, up by 10. And we've got more in store for you right after this. second half about to get started up again any moment. It's been an absolute clinic out there by Dewana Bonner. She put on a show from three-point range in the first half. We'll see if the halftime break had any cooling effect on her. Well, we'll soon find out because I guarantee they're going to keep beating her the rock beyond the arc until she does cool up. Now here's Thomas. Here's Bonner. Rebounded by Copper. the inside. Cunningham. That one's good. There you go. Well, not just a perimeter threat. Cunningham. Where's the other guy at? Oh, it was also dangerous it. on the interior. Pass huh. huh. to Harris. This one for three. And it's Brittany Griner with the rebound. Just like me, nine times out of ten, she's going to bury the three when she's left all alone like me. Huh. 
How is that not green? The Sun with the lead. Now Bonner. Pass to Harris. There's the three. And again, Connecticut no good. It's been a cold spell for them coming out of the half. This is their first three shots. Wild outside. Rossi on the wing, covered by Carrington, screened by Griner. Here's the Rossi. It's good from the top of the key. Well, it's that natural feel for the game Jesus. that allows Tarasi to see plays before they materialize. I mean, she's creating while other people are still getting up to speed. Now a timeout called by Connecticut. Chance buckets for a team. Here's Thomas. That shot off. Brittany Griner with a defensive effort. Out right side. Copper outside. Pass to Griner. Good. And the assist goes to Kalia Copper. They're going on a nice little run here. Let's go. And getting to the rack has been the key. They're getting point blank looks time and time again. Now here's Harris. Here's Harrington. No. Oh. It's a three. It's hauled in by Tarasi. It's a two point differential. Pass to Griner. And it's all even up. The road back into this game wasn't a short one, but they've managed to make it all the way back and tie this game up. And I'll admit it, at one point I thought they were toast. They've shown some serious character to battle this far back. I mean, I thought that they were toast too with the butter and jelly and everything. And they call an illegal screen here. Let's go. Those types of mistakes are magnified when it's a tight game like this. The idea of setting a screen on that play, it was the, the, the good idea, the right idea, but the execution was not. Yeah, you really want to set a hard screen, but you also want to make sure it's a legal one. Now here's coming in. Eight points for her. Buries the long-range jumper. It seems that every pass they make is leading to a score here. Just phenomenal ball movement. Everyone's looking for the best shot, and it's paid off during this run. Here's Harrington. She's got eight. Thomas. Clock at six. For one of honor for three. It's rebounded by Phoenix. It's almost like she's trying to make things hard herself. Work it around. Get an easier shot. Now Copper. He's got throw. Sinks the triple. <laughs> there isn't a whole lot they're doing right defensively. They haven't been able Be on the same page here in the second half. Right between the eyes. Trash of Cloud. Now here's Harris. She's covered by Cloud. Now here's Perrin. Shot to end the cold run. Thomas 
this left side. Bonner outside. Takes the three. Cans it from downtown. Henderson with it. On the wing, Rebecca Allen. Drops in the tray. Look at a half done smoke. making a change here and Connecticut has possession here's Harris Bonner outside shot clock at six pass to Carrington the three Oh, she's hurt too. They managed to overcome an off game from her offensively. And we've got an injury on the floor. Very unfortunate, as always, guys. Don't like to see this. Boy, that did not look good. Let's hope it's something not too serious. You've got to feel for her. You can see how much distress she's in. I just hope she's okay. Now, here's Petty. Pass to Harris. Let's go with a three. Mercury with the rebound. Yeah, she has been way off the mark this play. It is getting rough. Loud outside. The rebound by Harris. Well, they're in the lead, but, but she's still been frustrated offensively. Now here's Thomas. She's guarded closely. Pass to Nelson Adobe. Excellent D there from Brittany Griner. They've had the advantage out of the class. Another big one there. And a close game like this can be won or lost on the boards. They've got it. Ooh. Bye, Mom. I'll probably be at work by the time you come back. And a 
good chance for them to slow it down. Yeah, they should use some clock. Two minutes remaining in the game. Two minutes. Now Cloud. Down low. Minor. And the layup is good after a nice lead pass. Not afraid to play rough and rugged. Griner shows the ability to power through contact. Now here's Harris. Oh. oh, wow, guys. Doesn't look good. We've got an injury here. Man, this is something you just hate to see. Yeah, it's a tough part of the game. Hopefully it's not a serious injury. And I don't know why they kept her out there. Here. Yo, 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 come here, come here. To Rossi outside. Pass to Cunningham. Back to Tarasi. Watches it. That feels it. Three point range. Since the start of the fourth, Brian, that three point shot has really been there for them. Yeah, doing an excellent job, Tim, of finding the open teammate on the perimeter this quarter. The three pointer is a major mm -hmm. weapon for them right now. Pulls up, and she nails that one right through the net. Perfect screen there. Set her up with a terrific look. Yeah, but that's a bad job by the defender to not fight through that screen to contest. You want to see more effort there. Sophie Cunningham with a little step back. They are just not backing off. And they're going to close this one out in style. What a surge. Give me credit just to, to finish this one off. Pass to Petty. Back to Bonner. Six on the shot block. Oh. Good there off the double touch. And they are this close to putting it away. Yeah. And, and they don't have to do anything special. Just take time off the clock. But most importantly, don't turn it over. Yeah, don't pull it in. <laughs> well, this game's finally gotten away from them. It has. There's not really anything they can do. Copper oh. with the ball. And there's the call on on. That will get her a full foul of the game. Tried to step in and cut her off, but not quick enough. Yeah, just one step late to get there and didn't establish position. Just a tough, tough play for that defender. Let's go. And so it's Phoenix easily grabbing this one. A confident win and one where they clearly showed the greater effort. And they put on a show here at home. I think they had and felt like they had the edge and an extra confidence. That'll do it for our broadcast, everyone. Oh, damn. She got two injuries. <laughs> 